Hello everyone and welcome back to another Space Engineers video. Today, unfortunately, will be the last day of this build series. Uh, I've been having a lot of trouble with the update breaking mods and some of the mods that broke were quite crucial to the entire design of the ship. Uh, so it's it's kind of hard to go forward and also I guess it it might have done something to renderer or how it calculates something but the performance of this world has gone really down so I did get a little bit done let's kind of do our final walk through the ship if I do more work on the ship I definitely will be doing more updates so right here it's like really good the frame is really good here but as we get to different parts of the ship we'll uh, get some really bad frames that I've been experiencing so we got this room that we did a couple weeks or a couple yeah, a couple weeks ago captain's course I believe last week I really like this ship. This is one of my best builds, one of my favorite builds. And then we still have this really, which I did do a little bit of work to uh, you know, stretch out down here. A lot of lighting needs to be done. But let's head up to where I've been working this week. The kind of civilian layer. So this is where housing is for most of the scientists and all that. So let's go to the kind of lounge in the front. So this is the lounge. Couple of respect here. There we go. Now there's no lights in here, so night mode's kind of terrible. But as long as there's light here, it's really nice. These didn't come out as I wanted them to. They're kind of supposed to look like planters. But meh. The, uh... These plants look way better. I didn't spend too much time on this because I just wanted to get a quick room done and could come back and fish if I want wanted to. Or if, you know, it stopped uh, being dumb. Which it hadn't, so there's that. These seats are sitable on and all that. It's just a nice kind of communal area. So let's head back out the other door. Elevator. This hallway definitely needs something in it. Or what it needs but definitely needs something and this is kind of the where all the apartments would have been and it's where i figured out there's a giant problem with probably one of the most crucial mods uh, for this section is windows so this should be a one by one window let's see where's the other one by one that's one by three let's see if we can find it one by one window So this should be one block by one block. And I have the mods, I double checked, triple checked even. And it's it's a five by five, it's not a one by one. Because it's using the uh go away. The large block head to death. It's called scale. And for some reason I can't get it to uh fix itself. So yeah, that's one of the reasons. I don't know if the video is gonna come out. Really great because of the frame rates. It's just having all sorts of trouble. I, I am very keen to find the energy to do more on this ship. Oh, fine. But as it stands now, this will be the last video for a while. Uh, I will be doing more mod review stuff. Not mod reviews, but uh, mod lists. That was kind of fun last time I did that. So I got a couple more in mind. So stick around for that. Also, if you guys have any ideas for more videos, uh, I'll probably be doing some shorter series, like a planned amount of videos instead of an open-ended one. Um, and I'll be doing some other games too over the next few weeks. So going back to Star Citizen, doing some stuff there. Uh, maybe some Minecraft actually, because I've been playing a lot of that. A lot. Uh, way too much of it. I'm still building and I don't know why. But yeah, for now, this series will be kind of on a break, kind of done. I don't know which one will be. Hopefully I'll be able to return to this because it's so close to being done. Just have a general interior layout. Also, this ship will be available on the workshop, so check the link in the description. It will be there. So if you guys want to take this any further, you are free and welcome to do so. 
just make sure to let me know what you get to do with it. And I'd love to see. I just noticed there's some sticking out. That's terrible. That doesn't happen on there, just over there. Ah. Hmm. But yeah, that's what we got. Kind of, kind of sad. I'm really disappointed. I, I really wanted this series to be like a full series and and finish up the ship. Why did I lose a thruster? Where did that happen? <laughs> oh gosh. It on you if I maybe like a block off. Yeah, it's a block off. Mm. Yeah. Be placed there. Let's see. <laughs> Just gonna be annoying. It's going to be annoying. Let's see. Yeah. This. And place that. Why is the mounting pointer being what on earth? To the mounting point. Gosh. Yeah. Yeah, this latest whatever update or whatever went through. I haven't been keeping track. It's just bugged up everything. And now it's far too tall, isn't it? Yeah, okay. Okay. Yep. I'm just gonna... Yeah, it's gonna leave that there. I'll fix it later, hopefully. But yeah, this the frame rates are just uncooperative. I don't even know if they're, like, super low. Wait to check that. I don't think there's a way to check that in here, but if we see, you please cooperate here. Uh, settings. Ow. Oh gosh. It's just being all sorts of uncooperative. Settings. Where is email? Show. FPS counter top right. Should I be doing that? Not. Just not doing it. Interesting. There it goes. Can't see it on the stream, but we're getting about uh, 15. 15 frames. And I don't think that's to do with the build itself, because it's it has been working fine for a while. It's just since the update. Okay, well, I think I've rambled enough I'm trying to make this somewhere near a 10-minute video. So I hope you have enjoyed the series, and definitely stay tuned for more builds and a different sci-fi and... Hopefully some game development stuff coming soon. So yeah, I will see you guys later. Bye guys.